Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. Hey everybody, I'm Mike Maruzars and here are your 41 Action News headlines. The town of Garden City, Missouri was shocked to learn on Wednesday its entire police department was fired. 41 Action News traveled to the town about 50 miles southeast of KC to get some answers. This is what Mayor Daniel Cantrell told us. We cannot have these officers uh, a full uh, blown police department because we simply cannot afford it. As ugly as it is and as awful as, as it is, I have to do what is best for this city. The Cass County Sheriff's Office will now answer emergency calls in that town. Amid some anger over rising rates, there's a new plan to reduce utility bills in the City of Independence. City Council Member Mike Huff is proposing the city implement a 2015 electric cost of service. Now, it would restructure rates for industrial and commercial customers. It's estimated to reduce utility bills by 2%. The Public Utility Advisory Board will discuss that plan on Thursday. Kansas City Police are now learning how to fight crime from the NY. PD. Officers just returned from New York City to find out how New York dropped its homicide rate from 2200 in 1990 to 292 last year. Kansas City Police Chief Rick Smith says one takeaway was their technology. Another was their community policing. You can see the investment that's made there. But I think what they're saying is the trust those neighborhood officers build with the community overall is help reduce crime, help people to realize the police officers are there to work on their behalf and to work for the betterment of their communities. And so when you build that kind of trust, what they're saying is they're worth their weight in gold. Well, the chief says New York is also better at tracking gun crimes. His goal is to come up with a plan for Kansas City now moving forward. Your forecast is next. Did you know? A realtor will help guide you through the home buying process from beginning to end. Visit KCRAR.com for more information or to find a registered realtor in your area. In the last few nights, it's been 8 degrees, 12 degrees, and 16 degrees. Tomorrow morning will not be that cold, but still cold. 21 degrees, clear, calm, and cold. Some snow in St. Louis tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, 48, maybe 50 degrees. A nice sunny day. And then we look at a little bit warmer into the 50s on Friday with a high temperature of 52 degrees. A cold front blasts in Saturday, maybe a little bit of snow Saturday night or Sunday, and then warming up on Thanksgiving week. There is your forecast. Remember, you can get your news or weather anytime at KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.